You're next. Oh, shit. Sorry. Sorry, 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 sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. I didn't mean to hurt you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Wait. I guess we helped him. I just accidentally shot him off there. <laughs> Dear Miss Facklorn. Macfarn. Macfarlorn. Macfarlane. Stealth kill! Bam, bam, bam! Okay. Woo! I love the giant shootouts. They're so much fun. <laughs> what do you want? Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hi everyone, my name is Lauren and welcome to a brand new episode of Red Dead Redemption 2. I'm just gonna pick my favorite comment from the last video. Okay, so the comment is a bit too long to read out loud, but I'm gonna put the whole thing on the screen so you can read it if you want to, pause the video. Um, but the comment is by Alex Andre. Thank you so much for your really lovely, very extensive comment. Oh my god, I loved reading this. Thank you so much. It says, hey Bookie, I hope you're having an amazing day. Glad you're continuing the RDR2 playthrough. If you didn't know, St. Dennis is a perfect recreation of New Orleans. Very cool. And New Orleans has a major influence from France since the area of modern day New Orleans and the state of Louisiana was part of the French empire called New France. And then he states um, some little tips about where things are. Also, sorry for the long comment. Just really wanted you to see the sheer amount of detail Rockstar put into creating this massive open world and especially St. Dennis. Thank you so much. This was such a nice comment to read and I actually loved reading it. I just love the little details they put in. Thank you so much for pointing it out to me because I would not have known that. <laughs> so thank you so much. Without further ado, let's dive into the game. I'm gonna start keeping lists throughout my playthrough, I think, of things I need to do. I might also keep a little control cheat sheet at some point um just because i feel like i keep forgetting some of the controls and it's absolutely fine actually i think throughout the last video i really got back into it which is really really good i think one thing i need to train myself to do more often is use dead eye i need to make use of dead eye more often so that is my goal for this episode i'm gonna be using dead eye <laughs> gunsmith let's go oh it's closed is it Where's this at? This is it. Just try to get into some money. Watch yourself. Oh, pardon me, sir. Oh, he just stole my money. Ugh, can't be bothered. He just picked your pocket. Go, go after him. Okay, fine. Oh, well, he's gone now. Oh, why am I like this? All right, let's go back in. Welcome back. Change your mind on something? I'm gonna browse the catalog. Let me know what you are looking for. Thank you. That one's free. Can I take this? Thanks. Free gun. You I'll made take it. Decision. Um, guys, I think we're gonna come back. I think what we might need to do is explore a bit more. There's the bounty hunting that we can do, which I might actually do first. Let's go to our bounty. And then we can always come back and explore more. Alright, let's go. We're back on the road, people. Actually, my horse's health is not great. Let me see if we can um, feed it real quick. Yeah, you're a strong one, boy. What's happening? Easy. Is it over you're there? Okay. Are they killing people? I don't care if you're a tax collector, post collector, damn census taker. If you're in this state for the federal government. <laughs> you're next. Oh, shit, sorry. Sorry, 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 sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to hurt you. I didn't mean to hurt you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Wait. Put your gun away! Dude, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry! Oh, there's an alligator. There's an alligator. Dude, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Come back! Well, there's no point in following him now. I guess we helped him. I just accidentally shot him off there. <laughs> well, the guy doesn't hate us now. Did shoot at him. Oopsie! <laughs> Hi. 
Anyone here? Hello? Should we loot things? Fuck it. How would they know? Take it. Oh, what? Who? Hi. Hey, stop there a God minute, damn. will you? I got traveling to do. I want no part of that. Now, I seen your face. So don't make me come looking for you. Remember, not a word. Okay, he's running away, which means we can steal more. Let's take everything else. Let's loot things. Take the crackers. Poor guy. He's left stealing all of his stuff. He should have been back earlier, okay? It's not my fault. Ah, we should be getting near. Okay. He's wanted dead or alive. He'll be in this building, surely. Looks like some weird fort. Well, holy shit, we're doing it. Maybe I should go out here. Fuck it hell, this is a... Uh... Lindsay Wofford? I got here a warrant for your arrest. Or the other thing, if it comes to it. <sighs> a federal warrant? No, 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 that don't mean much in a sovereign territory, mister. We've been beaten down and driven out enough. Always shoot first. Are you dead eye? Yes, let's go. Last one. I'm just gonna eat something. Uh, use a health tonic. Oh god. This one up there. Okay. You go shake your hands with the devil today, boy. Oh my god, shoot him, thank you. you. Okay, doing pretty good so far. Okay. Come on, Arthur. Nice. Is that all of them? No, there's one up there still. Okay. Another one? Oh shit. I'm out of ammo? Completely? Fuck. Okay. Um. Shit. I need to go in there and grab a gun. Shit. I can't believe I'm doing this. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. No. <laughs> I didn't have a big enough weapon. I didn't have enough ammo. Fuck. I was so close, I feel like. Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! They're behind me! Arthur! Oh my god. Oh my god. What the fuck? They came from behind me! Okay, I think I need better guns for this. I'm coming back for this quest. Seems to be another city out there as well. Is that a city? That looks like a city. Wait, let's go there. Uh, what the fuck happened there? Uh, I'm sorry, boy. What happened?
Well, if he's dead, then might as well take his stuff. Right? Let's hope no one comes. Take the shotguns. Take everything. Oh shit, I'm sorry! What does it say? Dear Miss Facklorn. Macfarn. Macfarlorn. Macfarlane. <laughs> to Bonnie Macfarlane. I'm sorry, I said it. I'm sorry. You're right. I do let things get out, out of control in my head. I always have. I see that, but I love you. We're meant to be together. It's our destiny. I know it is. I saw us in a dream, raising kids. <laughs> you were very happy as my wife, and I was proud to be your husband. Dreams don't lie, and neither do I. I'm heading off to make my fortune. And when I come back a rich man, you'll see what a fine husband I will make you. And a father to our children. And no, I won't grow up. On that subject, you're wrong. I got so many things to say to you. I'm going to continue with writing this letter later. But believe me when I say we are destined for a long and happy life together. Even your father will come to believe and accept me, no matter my, how my humble my birth. Oh, that's kind of sad, bro. Oh, I can read this bit. Oh, that's it. Oh, put it away. We will find Bonnie. We will. We will send it to her. But first, I'm gonna take the rest of your stuff. Loot the lockbox. Take it. Oh, he did have like money and stuff. Mm. Well, thanks, dude. See you later. <laughs> I'll find Bunny for you and I'll tell her that you loved her. Don't worry. Yeah. I'll make sure you you're remembered. <laughs> you're a good boy. Von Horn. What is Von you're Horn? Is this a city of some sort? There's a boat there. Oh, oh, it is a town. Wait, how do I get into the town? Hey guys. Is that the boat? Oh! Okay, I'm sorry. I didn't realize that I wasn't welcome here. I thought I was just gonna explore this town. Jesus! Oh my god, aggressive much? Am I not welcome here? I just wanna check out this town. Okay, well, how about we set up camp? I'll just set up camp here. Oh. That's fire. Mind if I warm my bones? Who the fuck are you? <laughs> Y'all knew this was Murphy Hills. You should be careful where you're camping. I can look after myself. Besides, it's a free country. Free country? <laughs> no. Okay, Everyone well, I'm not coming back to this place. Everyone's really not that friendly around here. Y'all be careful where you wander. Come okay. On. Let's go. I think you got the message. Thanks for the we'll warning. See you next time. <laughs> the fuck? gonna cook some food <laughs> that was so weird what the heck who even are you guys I'm just gonna cook some more and then store it away so we can eat it um, and I'll go to sleep if you want to until noon eight hours oh I don't know what I pressed I pressed something very long <laughs> I meant to do eight hours 
Oopsie. Arthur, we need to cut your beard. Also, um, I just quickly want to check out my compendium. Yeah, the Murphy brood. Oh, look. Ugh, who's that guy? <laughs> Why do they all look a bit like orcs? Oh my goodness. The Murphy brood are believed to have immigrated to America in the 1700s where they lived comfortably. Industrialization of the area drove the family to live a secluded life in the hills. Now that the family now the family resides in a cave in Beaver Hollow, only venturing out to surrounding areas for hunting and scavenging. Okay. I survived one unique encounter with them. Oh my god. Okay, so they live in these hills. Interesting. Um, I just want to see if I can actually go in here now without people killing me. Okay, there should be a stranger encounter here somewhere. This doesn't look like a nice place. I don't like it here. Good work, pal. Hi. Howdy, fellas. Hi, mister. How you doing, friend? No. Bertram say no. Hey, oh, that's Bertram. Nice. Very nice. Oh, so she's the stranger. We said, and now the two of you have betrayed me at once. Do you know what betrayal means, Bertram? No. It means hurting Miss Marjorie. Well, I thought you liked me. I've clothed you. I fed you. Bertram does like Miss Marjorie. Mister? Yes. And Miss Marjorie he just spy me. Bertram. So why don't you go and tell me where that nasty Hi. little Everything magnifico okay? has... Imagine saving people, Down taking them to your breast, and metaphorically, I mean, like a mother, caring and raising them, and then they go and stab you in the back. Have you ever betrayed a close friend? I hope not. Well. Treachery. And these are sad, low, unlovable people, and I made them stars, dreamers, entertainers, and they... Oh no, now family's not enough. No, oh. no, I feel like he's, he's not gone supposed to be drinking. <laughs> My little tiny magician has gone and stabbed What is happening? <laughs> oh, fuck it, he. <laughs> no! Oh. Bertram! 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 Woof, woof! Bertram! Put the nice man down! What is going Do on? You only eat him! Um, uh, e e easy there. Uh, hey, dude. You're killing easy the. There. You're killing him. Sorry! Uh, oh, okay. Wait, 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 wait. I don't remember the controls. Big guy. Bartram got a whoops in you. No fair. There's no putting this off. Give him a whack. Naughty. Naughty. Mean what do you man. wait for? Slug him. <laughs> Bartram ain't little man. Well, well, let's be friends. I feel bad. <gasps> Yeah, let's stop. Ow. Okay. Okay. Come He's knocked here, out, right? Bertram. Oh, yes. Marjorie's here. Aww. No one's going to hurt you ever again. Mama, Seems like you he needed that. that thing in a cage. You should think about who you're serving. Give me a beer, will you? Don't worry. We'll pay for what we broke. Come Priorities. Here, Bertram. Oh, no one looks after you like Mama does. No one cares for you like I do. Especially not that Magnifico. Hmm? But he's my friend. Who's Magnifico is what I want to know. If your friend, he'd be here, wouldn't he? He wouldn't have abandoned us. Oh, you wouldn't have gotten that whoopsie, would you? Whoopsie heart. I know. Mama's going to make it all better. But first, you got to tell me where that little worm ran off. To, hmm? Bertram promise. Yes, well, Magnifico made a promise too, huh? He made more than a promise. He made a contract and he broke it. So you just tell me exactly where he is and then we will all be even. That's my boy. He sounds so evil. Why didn't you tell me in the first place? You just apologize to these men. 
I'm sorry. It's okay, dude. I'm sorry. It's okay. You gave me a whoopsie. Hey, you just stay away from that sherry now, you hear? Bertram, like sherry. Oh, don't you get him started. <laughs> Thank you for all of your help, well, Mr. Don't we all? Stranger. If you see that slippery little fella sleeping rough out there, would you just make a little racket and then we'll come along and we'll find you? I could try. Oh, his name is Magnifico. You'll know him when you see him. Come along, Bertram. Okay, I think I'll just hook tie him because I don't want him to die. Thanks, bro. That was, um, interesting. Did you finish your drink, Arthur? Okay, where's Magnifico? Let's look at this. Two members of a traveling sideshow, Bertram and Marjorie, are arguing about the disappearance of another member of their troop in the Von Horn Saloon. After intervening, a fight breaks out with Bertram. Right, I guess we're gonna have to find him. Hey there. Hey, bro. Uh, howdy. Hey. Hello, mister. You Go coming first. Someone else. Oh my god, everyone's so, like, mean in this town. Hey there. Partner? Oh, at least you're nice. Right, is there anything else interesting in this place? I well, guess not. What's this? FFF burnout. Oh, this is the place where we can play a game. Oh, there's a hotel there. Maybe we should try and stay at this hotel. It'll be a disgusting hotel. But, you know. At least we'll get a bath, I guess? It'll be fun to see what the baths are like in a different place. It's a very moody atmosphere here. All we need is some Pink Floyd and we're good. Is that dog dead? Oh my god. Like, what is this place? I want to go back to St. Dennis. I'm going to regret this bath. Hi. Howdy. I want to take a bath, bro. Hi! I have arrived for my bath. Oh, it looks disgusting. Uh, scrub your head. Go on, Arthur. Little scratchy scratch. You want some help in here? Sure. Deluxe bath. Yeah, Let's okay. do it. Sure. Why not? Sit back. No need to be nervous here. You'll be as clean as a baby in no time. Thank you. I don't mind a small talk. Look at the bubbles on his head. <laughs> uh, scrub my left leg. Whoops. Don't mind me. Uh, I was nearly married once. She never bathed me. Guess you'd like to share. Now my arm, please. Oh, been a tough few weeks. How about that? And then my right leg, please. Ugh. We don't like strangers much in this town. Yeah, that's how it goes in these parts. Mm-hmm. I've noticed. Thank you, ma'am. I'll be a little more careful with you. All right. I think I'm good. I hope to see you again. See ya. Alright guys, take another bath. You better shut up that pretty mouth. Come on, or I'll that shut ain't it the way to a woman's Stay heart. Back. This here's a private affair. Wait. No, no, no. Oh god, let's go after the the stranger. Get me off this horse. Come 
Come. Come, baby. Quick! Get me free! I will. I'm just gonna pat this horse. I'm trying to at least. Help me off this goddamn horse! Okay, I'm trying! Oh my goodness! Are you okay, lady? Please, cut me free. What happened? Oh, oh, thank the Lord you showed up when you did. Oh, the things he said he'd do to me. It's all right, ma'am. It's over now. Thank oh, you. I'm glad I saved Again. you. It looks scary. Do you need to, like... Do I need to help you to get somewhere? You're gonna take this horse. I'm gonna loot this guy. Nice folks around here. Yeah, real nice. See if I can take his um Oh no, I don't mean to pick him up. Drop him. Went to take his gun. God hey, damn it, boy. All right, let's go find Magnifico. Yeah. Did our first good deed of the day. I need to start selling some things, guys. I think that's something I might do next. I thought I was a person for a second. Oh my goodness. Oh, I see a fire. He just shot. Hey, dude. How are you? Whoa. Oh, oh my God. That's amazing. If you say so. Are you Magnifico by any chance? I'm not going back. She's a witch! She's a witch! Who? Presta! Well, Presta! <laughs> about you a lot. Well, I'm the talent. It's me. It's all me. I share the money with her. Of course. And, uh, uh, you know, that thing. No, stay away. You've made love to her, haven't you? I she literally met her succubus. once. She's a succubus! <laughs> stay away from me! Oh my me. god. Oh. Hey. Come back here. See right. Running and solving anything. I'm glad he's having a good time. She just wants to speak to you. Hey, oh, you he, talk. He went across. Going it alone. Where are you running off? Oh my god, this guy. You're starting to irritate. What the hell are you pulling here? You're here, I'm gonna find you. Oh, <coughs> that's a neat trick. Nope. Oh, yeah, very clever. What is happening? Oh my god, this guy. Hey, listen, I'm glad you're having a good time. Like, I'm here to support. Now, where you gone? Magnifico! Can't magic out of this, partner. Come on now, she ain't as bad as all that. Where are you, uh? Over here, dummy! Seriously, dude. Well, ain't you led me on a merry old dance. Come on down now. Lady said you had a contract. You want me? Come and get me! <laughs> uh, 
Sorry. Uh, hold on there. Ah. So Damn long, it. dummy. Oh my god, this guy. Bada boom, bada bim, symbol of him. There's a train, dude. Too bad about that train. Is he gonna be on the train? Oh, thank God. How long has I been in there? Oh no. That's kind of cute. I ain't back. I'm gone on the next train to the Great White Way. Really? You got enough for a ticket? Because the way Big Fanny tells it, you spent all of our takings on a case of the French pox. Maybe I did. So what? What do you need a stump of a showman for? Same bad jokes, the same cheap tricks in a package half the size. You got Bertram. I mean, there were some you good tricks. Not gonna there. lie. Who is dummy anyway? The missing link? <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, you dimwit! You sold me out. You should watch your mouth. You don't need me. You're better off without me. Even you, dummy. Go on, clear off. Aim for the top, all of you. I'm out of food and I'm out of ideas. Leave me for the bears. I won't be more than a mouthful. You robbed me. Whoa. You robbed uh, your brother. So you uh, are going to be pulling uh, rabbits out of your uh, ass until you are as uh, old as you are tiny. Uh, Put them up there. Ah, uh, some friends, some friends. We ain't friends. No. We're family, as much as it pains me to say it. Family? Still after everything? Well, of course you That's kind of cute. Man. And him? Let him at the bar agree to help. Ah, sleeping rough don't suit me much. I uh, know. Come to mama. Oh, I love that Arthur is just like you. randomly involved mm. in all of this. Yeah, don't you ever <laughs> run off on us like that again. Back together. Back together. What is I'm happening? It all worked out. <laughs> thanks to you. <laughs> Thank him, boys. Thank, Thank you. you. Uh, thanks for nothing, dummy. No hey, give me some bag. money. We ought to give you a piece of the gate on our next show. You earned it. Huh? We'll be playing Saint Denis next. Check with the box office. Here. Have fun. No one said anything about splitting so We can go the see game. the show. Oh, is that what this is? Half man and half wit. Bye, see bye, bye. ya. Bye. I done to deserve you too. That poor rabbit. Run for your life. All right. I guess we're going to Saint Denis. Saint Denis is why I kept saying. Cool. That's fun. Um. Love it. Hey, horsey. All right, where shall we go next? I feel like we should go back to camp at some point. Is this the overlook? Yeah, let's go to the overlook first. Yep. And then shave our beard, get our clothes together. Can I help you? Hey! Need a hand with your horse? Sounds good. How can I help? Oh! <laughs> Shit. Easy, easy. Oh my god, did he die because of me? Whoa. Easy. You're okay. It's okay. That's a fast horse.
Okay, um, so that happened. <laughs> Fuck, I didn't mean to distract Hi him so he'd die. Hi there, mister. Howdy. I'm wondering if I like should loot him. I'm doing it. Well, it's not my fault. How would people know? Ah, oh, this is fun. This way we get to keep our own horse and the other one to go all the way back with both. I now have two horses. All right, they've been hitched. I'm just gonna check them and compare. Um, yeah, this one's way less, less speedy. So I'm sorry, but um, it's time for me to take this other guy's horse. Just let me get this off, boy. Love you, bye. We now have a new horse. Sell him up. Got a faster horse, people. You sure know how to take care of a horse. Ah, oh, thanks, dude. Mr. Morgan, Mr. Morgan, you saved my life, and I'm well. I'm very grateful. That's fine, dude. Don't mention it, Reverend. I, I made a fool of myself. It's fine. We've all done it. I've done just, it. Just, well, not to that extent. I so confused but I have been and drunk. Angry, and then I, I hear God laughing at me and I get even angrier. And, well, I'm a real prized dolt. I know it. Okay, well, goodbye. Cool. All right, let's um quickly go take care of ourselves. It's needed. It's been a while. Right, let's shave first of all. Shave, and then we're gonna get our clothes. Let's trim our beard, all of it. Let's do this length. Damn, he looks a lot better like this. Nice Arthur. Then um, I wanna change his clothing. Outfits. Suitable for hot temperatures. This one's good for average. Um, I think this one's suitable for hot temperatures, which I want to store this on my horse. And then we need one for cold weather. So we have this. Uh, let's remove that one. And then... Oh, this one's cold. It's the only one, really. There we go. Cool, now we have all the temperatures that we want. Cool. All right, done that. Then, um, is there anything else that we need to do? Um, weapon locker, let's check. Actually, I wonder if we should donate the stuff to camp real quick. Oh yeah, that was it. First things first, Duchess one. Okay, if we get Duchess one, apparently we get something really good. So we need to update Duchess lodgings. Let's contribute some of the stuff that we have in our inventory. Uh, let's contribute. Oh no, sorry, let's open the ledger. Go back, go back, go back. All right, purchase. They have been upgraded. Other camp members have been inspired to contribute more. Woo! There you go, sir. Look at your fancy schmancy tent. You're welcome. Arthur wants a map to help plan journeys. 260? Oh my god, Arthur. Expensive taste, my boy. Oh, let's see actually if we can get some of this. I haven't had this in ages. Take a stew bowl. Oh! 
Did you guys just see that? We totally caught him. How dare you, Mr. Pearson? Well, go on and put it in. Go on. Arthur, Arthur, how you been? I've been real worried. What do you want? Don't be like that. I'm following the drama behind you, sir. Just a, just a few bucks. And I'm short. Get lost. Ugh. Well, I'll go try someone with a I just heart. donated so much money to the camp. Screw you. Damn, Pearson. Oops, no harm done. Apologies. What are we gonna do with him? All right, first I'm gonna take a nap. It's time to sleep. Till the morning. All right. Um, I'm wondering if we should try and go get Javier. If we go down there. And then cross the river there. I reckon we should try that. Let's take our new horse. Morning, Arthur. See ya. Alright guys, let's try this. Kind of curious to see how this is going to go. My god, this is so peaceful and nice. Is that a boat? Uh, good girl. Is that a boat I can steal? Yeah, I think this is where we cross. I think Javier is right there, somewhere. If we cross here, he's literally right there in front of us. I reckon we swim. Actually, I can cross right there. Hey, dude. Do you mind if I, like, secretly cross here? I'm kind of wanted in this area. So, um, I'm not gonna do you any harm. Oh, wait, I can examine this plant. Uh. Ow! What the f- oh, shit. The heck? Where did he come from? Hey, mister. Hey. Hey. What are you up to? Can I say hi to your dog? <laughs> right, don't mind me, I'm just gonna cross. I'm bleeding. Is he following me? Why are you following me? Don't be mean. Oh my god, Arthur, you're bleeding. Right, guys, we're back in our wanted area, so um, I think it's time that we um, sneak around and see if we can find Javier. We're trying to get him for two episodes now. I think today's the day. Getting close. I'm kind of wondering if we should um, put our bandana on. There we go. Just in case. Because there's a ton of bounty hunters around here. Apparently. 
Now where is good old Javier? Is that him? How many? A lot. Uniforms everywhere. You see Sean? No. I don't think so. Damn it. Where's Trelawney? <sighs> Who knows? Just keep your eyes open. I am. Hey guys. <laughs> Surprise. I love that it didn't look up. It could have been a hmm. lawman. Where is that little Irish best? I'm not quite sure. Trelawney's off trying to find out. Has anyone been in the black water to see how things lie? Place is crawling with Pinkertons, bounty hunters, and ah. pictures of Dutch and Hosea. Oh, well, we got a lot of money sitting in that town. And that's where it's gonna remain for now. Who's that behind us? Who's that? Why out? haven't they hanged Sean, I wonder? I think he's bait. Well, they wanna trial him publicly. Gentlemen, Sean is being moved up the upper Montana, then to a federal prison out west. Damn. We can't be rescuing people from some federal prison. We either rescue him now or we'll cut him loose. We're not cutting anyone loose. Of course not. Ike Skeldings, boys, are moving him to a camp nearby before handing him over to the government. So, I guess... We need to stop them before they get to camp. Charles, why don't you head up on the north side? And we'll head up on the other side of the valley and meet you. That way we have them in either direction. Javier, Josiah, come on. Let's go see. Uh, are we having a big shoot-off? Oh, God. You know, Arthur, the government, or people whom the government like, seem to be very angry. Sure. Well, we'll rescue Sean and then we'll get ourselves lost good and proper. It's a big country. I hope so. All right, it's happening. Holy shit. <laughs> Find the boat. Let's head up river and find this boat. Keep your eyes open for Pinkertons. They got patrols out all over this area. Yes, south of the river, West Elizabeth isn't a very welcoming place right now. It's definitely as bad as we feared in there, Arthur. I keep hearing about this woman, Heidi McCourt. Some young mother, they're saying Dutch murder. I reckon we should go down here. I don't know about that. I wasn't there. Bad day. And no money yet, it seems. I hope you know where that is, at least. We'll oh, wait. Be able to see much more from up here, dear boy. Okay, I figured we could be more sneaky from down there. But I guess not. Dutch and Hosea say they do, but it's trapped in the town. <laughs> oh, it must be wonderful to have such trust in one's parents. Okay, the boat should be here somewhere, right? I think those might be our boys. All right, gentlemen, follow me. All right, we're doing it. We'll follow them, nice and easy. Let's make sure it's him first before you go starting another war. Oh, sorry. You think they can see us? If they can, we're just three fellas out on the trail. Act natural, we'll be fine. So, you've been gone for a while. Much as I love dodging the law and sleeping in the dirt with you derelicts, I do have other business to attend to. What happened in New York? You know how life is. Never a straight road anywhere. Especially with you. Nice to know I'm missed, though. Have you run out of people to rob? Oh, we'll never run out of that people to rob. That is a good point, rob. and I still need to but do that. me, you'll not find the caliber of victim that I find. Let's go! Stay with them! You all right, Javier? You're quiet. He hasn't stopped talking since we left you in Valentine. It's the longest ride of my life. <laughs> cute, dear boy. Very so nice cute. of you. 
I'm actually thinking about robbing that place behind the sheriff's office at some point soon. Maybe at the end of this episode. I'll think about it. Push up, come on. All right, let's Apparently, get Apparently, there's a camp somewhere around here where the bounty hunters meet and transfer before continuing out west. I imagine that's where they're headed. It's tense, man. I'm nervous. Sorry if I don't talk too much. I'm like... into shore get your binoculars get our binoculars out. out let's see what we're dealing with here oh so who are these bounty hunters I don't know too much about Ike Skeldon's boys but I hear they're a big crew and wild built some reputation in the last year or two that looks like Sean to me certainly kicking up enough of a fuss <laughs> Yep, that's definitely Sean. Oh, they're giving him a decent kicking. Oh, bless well, him. You can only imagine the shit he's been giving them. Oh, yes. Don't go down on the fight, I guess. They're taking him up the canyon. What's up there? There's Charles on the other side. Let's go. What about the other two down there? I've got an idea. Follow me. Alright, care to share the idea or no? Okay. Man. Leave it to me, gentlemen. I'll go around and create a distraction. Then you two sneak across and do the dirty on them. Okay. okay. Stay here. Hello, Javier. Okay, let's move down. Don't cross until he's got their attention. You said don't cross. We're here. We're still reeling them in. Gentlemen. Gentlemen. Excuse me. Dear brothers. My wife is taken ill. Gravely ill. What's the problem? It's dear Bessie. You she take the one on the left. Okay. Okay, come on. Stay low. I, I'm beside myself. I, if I lose, if I lose Bessie, I lose everything. Oh, calm down, mister. I, I can't. I can't. I, I'm having a fit. Stealth kill! Bam bam bam! I've done it. Oh. Come on, let's get I up can there. swap the hat. I don't want to though. I might loot them. As always, gentlemen. I think you have it from here. Loot. Loot. And then does this rifle look fun? Come pick it up. Come on. We got two halfway up the canyon to deal with. Um. <laughs> How do you want to do this? Oh, they're very nice. Who's the guy you got them from? <laughs> Is he alive still? Move. Come on, focus. Oh. Focus, okay. Come on! You need to get back, you fucking bitches! Get up there! 
Got him in the knee. There's one up there. Well, we're going. I need some loot. Move. Okay. Yes, let's go. Vamos! I'm trying! Oh shit. More coming in on horses! Up there! On the cliff! Oh, uh sorry, one sec! Well, I'm going in. Get him! Go, Charles, go! I'm running! I don't have stamina, I'm sorry! Nice. Keep going, my dude. Here's Charles. All good? Wouldn't go that far. The camp's up this way. Come on. I need to loot things. Oh! Watch out! Sorry. I'll take the left side, Charles. You go right, okay? I guess. I guess I'll go middle. Take them down. Goddamn army of these bastards. How much is Sean's bound? Maybe we should turn them in ourselves. Okay, listen. It's time for my carbine rifle, baby. He's definitely dead now, right? Where's the next one? Oh, there. Yeah, I definitely got you then. Oh, up there. Stop hiding behind your friend's body. Where? I'm trying to see where they are. You move you're done for. You move up. Come on. I don't believe it. There's more. Oh, look at that guy hanging there. Okay. Okay. Woo! I love the giant shootouts. They're so much fun. <laughs> You're right there, dude. Hey, someone cut this rope. Me head's killing me. Cut, cut him down. <laughs> you know, you're a lot less ugly from that. He looks like Billy Arthur. Weasley. Bill Weasley. <laughs> Do I get a hug, Arthur? A warm embrace for a lost brother now found. Hey, dude. You know, nothing means more that was than fun. Me this gang. The bond we share. It's the most real thing to me. I would kill for it, I would happily die for it. But in spite of all of that, I would have easily left you here to rot if Charles hadn't stopped me. <laughs> I don't believe a word of that, Arthur. Get mm -hmm. him out of here. 
You're a great man, Arthur Morgan. Mm-hmm. You're quite a young whippersnapper can really admire. Oh, shut up. What right, What a name, whippersnapper. How dare you escort Mr. McGuire back to camp? Charles, best you ride separately. Be careful. There's patrols everywhere. What about you? I want to go loot all these bodies first. Yeah. Out. Meet you back there as soon as I can. Although right. I kind of want to stay de- have these guys stay okay, around. Okay, come on. While <laughs> I, I loot. stories for you. Yeah. I can't wait. Before I get attacked. I imagine y'all miss me a lot. But fear not. The joy is back in your lives now. Love his accent. Right, let's loot camp. Got a tomahawk. Come on, I hope we get a lot of loot out of this. It's needed. I'm so broke. Oh, someone cleaned up all the bodies. Um, we've done this. Blackwater's down there. Um, we can go back and see and if we can talk to John Marston at the Horseshoe Overlook, actually. Let's do that. Yeah. I hope you guys are enjoying the episode so far. Make sure that if you are, you give this video a like and a thumbs up. It would mean the absolute world to me, guys. Thank you so much. I'm just gonna see if we can find our way back now. Oh, the music is so good. Okay, I feel like I need to slightly embrace the outlaw, outlaw, sorry, outlaw life a bit more. As in, like, try and rob some people and buildings and... I don't know, it's just because I'm not that kind of person, I guess. Not that I'm saying that people who, like, do want to be the bad guy in these games. Like, it's more fun, I guess, um, to be, like, to fully embrace being the bad guy. I think I just need to get over it and just do it. So I'm kind of wondering if I should just rob that place behind the sheriff's office in Valentine. Because there was a secret operation there. Maybe I should. Don't know how to go about it, but I might try it. I'm also really proud that I've been using a lot more Deadeye in this, so I feel like I still fully need to embrace it. But um, it's already a lot better than I did before, and at least I know how to use it. <laughs> I just need to learn to sit targets now. Hey, can I, can I help you? Yeah, do you smoke, sir? Sure. Sure, but perhaps not as much as you. Oh, <laughs> no, no, don't worry about this. Actually, well, take some, take a couple of packs. Take a few. Oh, thank you. Oh, wow, thanks. What are all the cigarettes for? Are you heading on a long journey or something? <laughs> no, 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 nothing like that at all. I'm just interested in the cards. Okay. Cigarette cards. Oh, you got any? Yeah. Oh, I do. Well, get them out. Let me take a look. Come on, come on. A little picture card? Yeah, I'll pay you a good price. Okay. Here. Ah, nothing I haven't got. The value is in completing the set. Sometimes I'll smoke up to 200 cigarettes in one day, just so I can keep opening the packs. Oh I wish my I could God, to you bro! The pleasure and the pain I get out of collecting these babies. Sure, well, it sounds. Uh, sounds thrilling. like you yeah, got a problem to me. Not to mention the vast amounts of life reaffirming cigarettes I get to smoke. Oh, and the amount of money. <laughs> a veritable fortune, sir. Fortune. Oh, sure, sure. A complete set of any series is worth a fortune. Yeah, look at this. Gunslingers. Over here? Is that Dutch? Circus freaks. Yes, yes, yes. Meow meows of the desert. <laughs> so rare. <laughs> meow meows. Sure. How much? Well, it depends on the rarity, sir. Oh, of course. Yeah. But you know, if you ever get a complete set, I can uh, take it off your hands. And you'd pay me a fair price. Now, that you is send good to, me to right know. Here. Phineas T. Rampbottom. At your service. All right. Thank you, I Phineas. I gotta run. This is my train. Look me up, okay? Think about this deal. I'll, go, I'll come Only find you. Only a complete set. That's where the value lies. All right. I'll try and make one. Oh. I can check it. Phineas. Wow. Flip it. Oh, there's nothing on there. Well, put it away. All right, let's go. That was fun. <laughs> <laughs> he needs to work as an addiction. But that's fun. It's kind of like collecting Pokemon cards, I guess. Like shinies. But make it cigarettes. Oh, Arthur. Hey, Dutch. Are you in a good mood? I am, son. Smoking a I cigar. Am. Let's have some fun. Tonight. Let's enjoy our. Alright, let's have a little party night. Are we having a party? Maybe. Just a little. One. That sounds fun. Let's do that. Great. Mr. McGuire is back. So come on! Let's have ourselves a party. Hey there. This sounds fun having a party. 
You didn't need clothes. much excuse. You're looking lovely. Somebody you needs to show you all how it's done. So. Did you miss him? Yeah. Mercedes. I haven't seen her in ages. <laughs> Me too. So, what now? Come on. How about a song? <laughs> He'll be drinking till dawn now, I bet. Oh, let him Listen, have some my fun. Friend. He's been through a lot. You know the I thought you lady. Irish enjoyed a party, Molly. I am enjoying it. I just don't need to fall over drunk with the rest of the party. That's the one. You know this one, don't you? Go join in. <laughs> Start singing. Go on, Arthur. And she was mistress of her trade. It was diddle, diddle, diddle all the day. And upon her toe, Mark well. Rather low, diddly diddle day. It feels so like nice and safe here and so cozy. Look at the reverend getting se sneaky snacks. That was fun. God, the reverend looks drunk. Cheer up, Strauss. It's a party. What do you mean? I'm in an excellent mood. Let's go hang with these guys. I will never forget. And that's that most fellas are sheep. That's right. And and if you can tell the difference between a the difference between a sheep and a, a, a sheep and, and a man, then you well you that you, that makes you a better man than me, sir. And that's all I'm saying. So you, you got your buddy words, back. You mark my words. Wasn't the same without him. Oh, oh. I love Lenny. Jose has been really quiet the past few days. Sheep. Well, I should get back to it. Okay. All right, let's leave. I am ready to let loose tonight. I kind of wish we had some drinks. <gasps> Who's dancing? Oh, look, Dutch and his girl are dancing. Dutch and Molly. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, sure. Go on, let's dance. Sure. I ain't much of a dancer. Oh, look at the reverend. Oh, God. This is so cute. What does flare mean? What does flare? I'm gonna press it. Oh, that was cute. Say, Arthur, it's okay to dance. Doesn't mean we won't stop thinking you're angry and <laughs> Wow, the shade. Sad in a good way, like a romantic poet. Mary Beth is super pretty. About all I can muster. Look at them giggling behind us. <laughs> Feels like ages since we've done this. Things are on the up again. Fine. This is so cute. I want to find Sadie. Look, everyone looks so drunk. I wish we were drunk. Where are the drinks? All right, thank you for the dance, my lady. I want to see if we can find an... Uh, there's hey. no alcohol. Well, thank you, Mr. Morgan. <laughs> thank you. Thank you again for the dance, Miss Gaskell. Anytime. You're better than I thought you'd be. Oh. Mr. Morgan. Morgan. Reverend. What? What do you want? Hello. Hello. <laughs> what do you want? I'm not. I'm not quite sure. Oh. I'm gonna this go talk happening. to these ladies. 
Sadie's here. Hey. How are you doing, Mrs. Adler? Uh, not really in the party mood. I understand. Why not? All right, well, I should be getting on. If you say so. You all right? Yeah, it's good to have him back. Well, let's see if we're still saying <laughs> that in a day or two. Probably not. Okay, I'll catch you later then. Take care, Arthur. Well, let's sing one more song. All right, guys, thank you. Oh, God, the reference. Such a mess. Oh, hey guys. It's so nice to get everyone just hanging around, having a good time. Of course. We're old men, Arthur. Let us live in our memories. I want to be part of this. We did it. What was Classic Sean McGuire speech. <laughs> yes, he's definitely back. We needed a reason to celebrate. A little bit. Is she about to throw up? <sighs> She's about to go throw up. <sighs> <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> this is so funny. Right, we're gonna go to bed, guys. I don't think there's a lot left to happen. So let's go pass out. Um, till the morning, that's five hours. That's something. <laughs> that was super fun. How's everyone feeling after the big party night? Hey, how are you feeling? Real heavy in Blackwater, Dutch. Posters of you and Jose everywhere, Trelawney said. Well, yeah, All the more reason to stay uh, well away just, for now. He's still going, the Reverend? No intention of going back anytime soon. I'm gonna round off this episode. Thank you all so much for watching. Make sure that if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more. Thank you so much, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!